hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel i greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video we are still on the gist from the palace of oni of Ife, my people <laughs> hey okay oh no be smart you know i don't say for weeks now all we have been hearing on social media is uh, Ronke is pregnant, Ronke is carrying a male child, Ronke wants the king to travel abroad with her, Ronke is looking for trouble in the palace, Ronke is blasting everyone, saying that she's pregnant, and all of that. Say, hey, my people, my people. And a lot of people have reacted to that especially online in-laws especially uh, pro naomi they blasted her some of them told her that you an old cargo cannot get pregnant at this stage others we are saying anyways what god cannot do does not exist that if it can happen in the bible that uh, it can happen uh, also in the physical hmm. Because from what we are hearing, we heard that Ronke is about 52 years old. Some said 52, others said 62. But with all this uh, 52, 62, we can uh, tell that uh, Ronke is almost at the age of menopause. That is if she is not uh, uh, in menopause already. So trying to convince us that she is pregnant with all this drama that is going on in the palace, uh, it takes god's grace anyways although we are not trying to say that god cannot do it but what they are saying is that it is not possible that Ronke is just doing that to distract the king from the arrangement of bringing queen naomi back to the palace others have said a lot of things concerning this Ronke of a woman some said that Ronke is a bad person that she's one of the people that they uh, uh, if i said that would dethrone the king if the king is not careful enough and a lot of people talked so many things when they, uh, we heard allegedly that Ronke told the king that she is not going to have her baby here in Nigeria and she's not going to stay in the palace due to some physical and spiritual attacks that they are getting someone like uh, Toby have said it some time ago allegedly that why her babies are not staying that she always conceived but the baby is not staying because of all the attacks they are getting physically and spiritually and that was why she left to her father's house uh, the last time she said she was pregnant so with all of this a lot of people have been blasting uh wrong okay? saying all sort of things against her some in her favor because there are others who are congratulating her because in as much as uh, some people hate her, there are people who love her too. So, some of her fans, we are congratulating her, saying, if it is true, thank God, oh, this is what we have been praying and all of that. Why others are saying it cannot be true. And from the look of things now, they said, Ronke don't confess. She don't confess. But before this, her confession, let's record that uh, they said, when Naomi blasted the king some days ago, and told the king to stay off her lane and also warn her olories not to come close to her again when we heard that uh, this uh, lola lola went to akure to see queen naomi they said queen naomi disgraced her and called the king to warn the king to warn her never to come close to her again that uh, according to what we heard though they said naomi told the king that everything about her he should uh, erase it from her mind that all she he wants now is uh, her freedom that he should focus his energy towards his uh, wives and the pregnant wives you know that pregnancy uh, Queen Naomi also hears about it so and that was why they said she told the king to focus on her pregnant wives because some we are saying too that uh, uh, Toby is pregnant too. I don't know if it is true or not. So, but it is then that they said the king told Queen Naomi that there is no woman. There is no woman. And we do know that Ronke is a woman, Abby. Mm -hmm. But the king said there is no woman who is pregnant for him. That he doesn't have any pregnant woman anywhere. With this alone, we have 
or concluded that uh, Ronke is not pregnant. So it was after this, maybe after this discussion, that we started hearing that uh, Ronke have confessed, saying that the reason she came out to say that she is pregnant is because of the king's attitude towards all of them in that palace. That the king will always make reference with uh, Queen Naomi that there is nothing, there is no day that he is talking or speaking to them without involving Queen Naomi, always using Queen Naomi as an example to them. And they now concluded that it is because Queen Naomi have a son for the king that that is why uh, Queen Naomi is always in his mouth. But they forgot that what the king shares with Queen Naomi is different for, from what the king shares with them. So my people, they said, uh, as this uh, went on and on and on in the palace, uh, it began to, it, it got to a point where they become more jealous by the day. And they said, according to what we are hearing, you know, they said, Ronke said that you hardly get the king's attention. But if it is Queen Naomi that don't even want him, he will be rushing to Queen Naomi. Okay, if I thought there's any, any loaded uh, opportunity, uh, if Dr. Elizabeth is not there, Maria will be there with her troubles. So she needed attention. She needed serious attention from the king. And he knew, uh, uh, she knew that the moment she claimed that she is pregnant, that the king is going to give her more attention. That that was why they said she claimed that she is pregnant. And with this, it simply means that Olore Ronke is not pregnant. I don't know if you guys are understanding what I'm saying. So from what we are hearing, Ronke is just jealous of Queen Naomi because uh, the king is always making reference with Queen Naomi, saying that Queen Naomi is this, Queen Naomi. They said the way she praises Queen Naomi in their presence, it shows them that they are nothing compared with Queen Naomi. And this is, in as much as uh, I like it, but it is bad because you cannot be telling a, a women when you know that... Uh, these people see Queen Naomi as their rivals. It will also increase enmity between them and Queen Naomi. So they said that is why Ronke decided to draw the attention of the king to himself and all to himself. That had it been his, she succeeded in traveling abroad with the king, is just to spend some time with, with him and come back that she is not pregnant. That is what we are hearing allegedly. I don't know if it is true or not. So my people, now so we hear them, and I was like, eh? What of the other time they said she was making trouble with everybody, and they were saying it's a uh, early pregnancy signs and all of that. Anyways, whichever when the, the only thing we can see from here is that she is just jealous of when Naomi and wanted the king's attention. That's all. So any other thing now she knows. So my people, now so we hear them. Don't forget that they are all alleged information because me, I did not hear from Ronkeo mm -hmm. because I don't know, I do not live in the palace. Always bear that in mind. This is not for sound information, it's all alleged information, okay? So, thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and share my video and subscribe to my channel if you're here to subscribe. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. My God will bless you and support you. Don't forget, I still love you guys. Bye for now.